tailgate fuckers and fuckheads, just a real quickie here because I had somebody call and didn't understand the difference between a single fire and a double fire coil. Well, the difference between to me is on a single fire coil, if one side of it goes wrong, you can get the fuck home. You're on one cylinder, but at least you can get home. I don't know why they named them this way. I don't give a shit. I'm a dumbass redneck. I just know that you know when I order, when I go to order them. Well, this is what they tell me. But a single fire coil, both of these fire at once because there's only two terminals on the sum bitch. All right. And yeah, this is off a jet bike, but it's the same goddamn thing. That's a double fire coil right there. Both of them fire at once. You only got two sets of terminals. That is one coil that fires every fucking round. And it's a tech piece of shit, so it runs a little bit hotter too. Um, let me set this down. A single fire coil. There's your hot. And there's each side of the coil. That's actually two separate coils in there. And that will get you home when one dies. Of course, now if this little motherfucker goes out, your head, you're stuck on the side of the road. But uh, thankfully, XL makes a damn good ignition pickup. Anyway, that's the difference between single fire and dual fire. Um, and that, you know, the difference on this XL box, I don't even have to look at the book. Is move switch number one up, and that's in that's in dual fire mode right there. No, I haven't set my advanced curve or no shit like that yet. Fucking took all morning for me to Google up that damn cam to figure out where I should set it. But uh, anyway, I hope that was explanatory for y'all, and I'll let y'all fuckers and fuckheads later.